Yeah, g'day, this is just an updated video from my last one on how to hook up the AC68U Zeus modem router for the NBN. Um, basically what I'd done before was um, I'd um, ran that modem on top of the my Republic one that they supplied to get it to work. Um, well, I just wanted to bypass it all together but after doing a lot of searching on the internet and reading and stuff like that I finally found a way to actually get it now to work uh, by itself without having to run it through the my republic modem that they supplied so it's now running straight from the M N NBM box and um, and through that now so which is good so which is what I wanted to do um, just let you know like I did last time in the last video I'm not an expert at this okay so I don't have all the answers and that this is just a lot of um, trial and error that I did a lot of reading on the net about it so um, about what people say to do and what not to do and stuff like that so and with some help of a friend we finally got it to work um, so um, yeah and, and one other thing to anybody running a I'll show you hey if anyone's got a gigabit board um, I've got the G1 gaming board but I've got a gigabit board um, and it comes with a uh, software uh, called Killershot Pro so if anyone's running Killershot Pro on their system um, just let you know now uh, just get rid of it delete it from your system because that will really mess you up uh, when trying to get your internet to work um, on the NBN. Yeah, it, it messed me up and I couldn't get a proper connection through this alone. And we found out it was just by mistake, it was the Killer Shop Pro. And once I sort of did a bit of searching online about it, um, a lot of other people said, yeah, they've had a lot of problems when it comes to the Killer Shop. Pro and that so um, if anyone's running at least at the very least a gigabit board with that software get rid of it get rid of the software off your system because it fixed my problem so anyway we'll dive in we'll have a look at my settings and you can have a look and um, um, see how I set it up and that okay so here's my setup um, for the modem uh, just go down to WAN, go internet connection, and basically this is what I've inputted. Um, if you can follow that, um, it's pretty simple. That um, with the um, the eight hundred two one Q, uh, don't enable it because it doesn't work. Uh, I tried it, I tried inputting certain numbers down in the VLAN ID like people suggested, this, that and the other, and it doesn't work. It will mess up your connection. No, so don't don't enable that. Once you've followed all that, just hit the apply button. And then we're gonna go over to dual WAN, and this is important. You wanna have dual WAN enabled primary set to DSL, secondary to Ethernet WAN. My WAN port I left on the default LAN port, which is one. Um, with the dual WAN mode, I just left it as is and ticked the box beside it to allow fallback. Uh, these numbers down here in auto network detection, I just left as is and hit the apply button and that's it. That's all I did, and it's working fine now. So, um, yeah, look, I hope you found this video helpful. Um, by all means, if anyone's got any constructive criticism on how it could be better or, you know, suggestions or anything at all, um, feel free to leave a comment and, and share your thoughts on it. Um, if you think I could have done something different or a bit better, you know, uh, feel free to leave a comment. Uh, I've just basically put this video up 
to help other people who have had issues with trying to get the ASUS AC68U to work on the NBN. Um, and, and that's all I've tried to do is just yeah, help you guys out, you know. Oh, and like I said as well too, um, if anyone's running um, um, software Killer Shot Pro um, on the Gigabit board, I don't know if they come with any other boards, but on the Gigabit board anyway, um, make sure you get rid of it, delete it from your system, uninstall it, because it will really mess up your connection. Uh, basically what it was doing for me was um, it kept wanting to just um, bypass my hardwired connection to my PC and go wireless all the time for some reason yeah um, and it was just messing it up uh, no matter what I did so uh, like I said a lot of other people were that I uh, did some research and a lot of other people that were running Killer Shop Pro have had the same issue with it and they reckon just uninstall it, get rid of it and uh, that fixed my issue. So yeah, like I said guys, I hope you found this video helpful and um, yeah, thanks for watching again.